Hey anyone, if you're there, if you can hear me and see me okay, please do give me the thumbs up. Let me know you're there, please. Thank you. We've still got a couple of minutes to wait yet, I think. Hey Rosie, it's good to hear from you. It's been a little while. Okay, what time are we on? Right, one more minute gang, and we'll do our little intro. Too long, yeah, you're right. I'm really well, Rosie. I hope you're doing well, along with everybody else out there. If you're joining us, please do say hi. Let me know you can hear me and see me okay. We'll give it 30 more seconds and we'll do our intro. Okay, I think we'll make a start everybody. So, good afternoon. Thanks for joining me live today. I am currently at a friend's, hoping that their internet connection is a little bit more reliable than mine at home. So, fingers crossed that this one is gonna go the whole way through. So, today we're doing a 30 minute class based on different kinds of lunge. So, we're gonna be looking at eight different kinds of lunge. So you should be an absolute pro by the end of it, I'm hoping. Our first round is going to be slightly easier so we can get, an, get a feel for the exercises. You're going to do 30 seconds work with a 30 seconds active recovery. So all that means is that we're basically going to stay on our feet and keep the circulation moving through our legs because we're just going to hammer the same muscle group and we should feel it by the end. Second round we're going to go slightly harder, 40 seconds on with 20 seconds active recovery. So. We're going to make a start on a three minute warm up in just a second. As we always say, if you do have any injuries or medical conditions that you're aware of, please always work within your limits and only exercise in a way that the doctor's advised is safe for you. Okay, so we're going to start our timer. Hopefully you've got a little bit of room around you for lunges. If you're in a small space, we'll work with it. I haven't got quite as much space as I'd like, but we can do it. Right. So, on your feet everybody, hopefully the music's at an okay level, do let me know if not. Right, I'm going to start nice and gently first, so we're just going to lift the knee, back to the floor, lift the knee, back to the floor, really gentle. Really lift that knee as hard as you can, big range of motion. Get a little arm pump in too. Okay, we're going to have a little shuffle, side to side, foot to foot. Good, we're going to take it into heel flicks. So, here we go, lift at the back. Good, get those heels up, right to the bum. If you need to slow it down a bit, just step and curl. Keep that intensity if you can. Good. 
this last few seconds. Okay, we're going to take a lunge position, a nice low lunge to start with. So take one leg forward, we're just going to drop that knee to the ground and straighten back up. So we're going to stay in our lunge position, drop that bend in to the floor, straighten the front leg. Nice slow up, nice slow down. Keep that back nice and straight. One more, and we're going to change sides. Switch. So, other leg out, other leg back. Last one. Okay, come to the middle. We're going to forward lunge, a little bit more pace. So, come forward, step back in. Other leg forward, step back in. Power down, power back up. Good. Get that knee down to the floor if you can. Last one, we're gonna heel flick to finish. Last little heart raiser. Three, two, one, slow it down. Okay, hopefully that's brought our heart rates up, ready for a start. So, our first lunge is going to be a basic forward lunge. So we'll very quickly cover the basics and the technique that you're gonna need, and then we can make a start. So, pretty much what we were just doing there, you're gonna start in a normal standing position, you're gonna lunge forward with one leg, and then that back knee is gonna come down to the floor. Sorry you can't see me completely. The key thing is that you get a nice long enough step forward that this knee is not over the toe. If you don't step forward enough and you come down, you're gonna see that knee rock past the toe. That's not the form we want. We wanna get a really good step forward for this lunge. Okay. We've got 10 seconds and our timer's gonna start. So, 30 seconds, basic forward lunge, first one. Get ready. I'll stay side on just for now. Okay, make a start. So, step forward, front knee stays behind the toe. Power back up, next leg. Alternate your legs on this one. Get that form, so there we go, I'm losing my balance because I'm trying to look at you guys. Look forward, focus on that balance. Front knee stays behind, power back up. Get that form, then pick a bit of pace up. Last few seconds. And pause there. Right, we're not going to stand still, I just want a little shuffle. Little shuffle. Okay, next one. It's gonna be a reverse lunge, so pretty much exactly the same thing. Rather than stepping forward with the lead leg, we're gonna step backwards instead. So allow yourself the room to step back. We're starting in three, two, one. So take that step back, exactly the same form. That front knee is behind the toe. That back knee, just above the floor, if not touching. Don't put any weight through it. See that my back is nice and straight and upright. Good. You've got under 10 seconds to go. Once you've got that form, pick a bit of pace up. Last one. Pause there. Stay on your feet. If you can, take some heel flicks. Oh, it's warm doing it inside. The weather looks a bit dodgy outside. Stay on those feet. Okay, next one. We're doing lateral lunge, so this time we're going sideways, slightly different form. You're going to step to the side, lower that knee, other leg stays nice and straight. Timer started. 
Go for one side, and we're going to swap halfway. So power back in, down, as far as you can go. Back in. Really get that knee bent. Side view. See that my back remains straight and in line with my bum. Change sides, other leg. Power down, back up. Last two, one, good. Stay on your feet. Nice, quick first round. Obviously guys, if you're having small sips of water, I don't advise jumping around whilst you're doing that. It's gonna be an absolute mess. So you can pause for a very quick drink. Okay, next one. We're doing a Bulgarian split squat. So this time we're gonna hold our lunge position and just go down and up, just like we did in the warm up. Make a start, we're gonna swap legs halfway. So take your stance, lower that back knee, straighten, back knee, straighten. Nice, up, down, get a good rhythm and a good pulse. Okay, change legs, come in, swivel, and other side. Last three. Two, one, good. Normally with that one, we would have our back foot raised up on a little bench, something like that. But some of us won't have that kind of equipment at home. So we'll stick with it that way. Stay on your feet. Next one, we've got a curtsy lunge. So your hips are gonna stay square. We've got 10 seconds to go, stay on your feet. That leg is gonna go behind and you're gonna take that lunge down, back round. Right, make a start. So, hips will always stay square to me. Keep your hips square to me. Take a foot behind, squat down, back up. So legs reach behind, curtsy down. Do not twist those hips round, keep them forward. Good, you've got 10 seconds. Keep working, hips square. That back knee should be coming down to the back heel. Rest there. Stay on your feet. If you need to, slow the pace slightly. Bring it into some heel flicks. Keep those legs moving around. Okay, next one. We're combining a couple of moves. So we're gonna do a reverse lunge and a knee drive. We've got Couple more seconds on the clock and make a start. So you're gonna reverse lunge. When you drive up, pump that knee. Stick with one leg. Come back, drive the knee at the top. Pump. Woo! Keep going. Terrible looking at you guys, my balance. We'll stay this way. Change legs. Pump, pump. Get a rhythm, last three, two, one. Good, stay on your feet. We've got two more for this round. How are we doing out there? Okay, you got just under 10 seconds, our next one. We've got a pendulum lunge, so we're going to keep one foot planted on the floor, the other leg is going to go forward lunge, reverse, so keep your left foot on the floor for me, forward lunge with the right leg, reverse lunge with the right leg, we're going to go forward, back, so we're swinging like a pendulum, we're going to swap our legs over in just a minute, swap legs, so right leg stays on the floor, take a reverse lunge, Forward, reverse, forward. Last couple, and rest there. We've got one more on this round. Last one is the killer. We've got a jump lunge. So nice plyometric exercise to finish. I am absolutely roasting up here. Okay, 10 seconds. Stay on those feet. So, last one for our jump lunge. Assume your lunge position. 
Right, buzz it started. So take that lunge. I want you to jump and change legs. Jump and change legs. Make those feet break contact with the floor. If you've got any ankle or knee injuries and that's too much for you, just take one of the previous lunges. I'd advise you stick with the Bulgarian split. Everyone else out there, no excuses. Power the jumps. Last three, two, one. Rest there. Oh, how are we doing? So that is our first round out the way. Nice and quick. Hopefully we have felt that a little bit on our legs. If you didn't this first round, you will on the second. We're doing an extra 10 seconds work. Oh, with an extra, well, less. 10 seconds, less rest. Oh, okay. Hopefully, you've got a feel for these lunges now. Most of the techniques are exactly the same. So, our next round, we're gonna absolutely power through. We've still got about 45 seconds on our clock before we're gonna start again. So, get your breath back, have small sips of water, but please, please, don't stand still, even if you're just sidestepping, side to side. Keep those legs moving, keep the circulation flowing. Oh. Right, keep moving, we've got 15 seconds and we're gonna start again. Our first exercise is our basic forward lunge. Alternate your legs, no switching. Get ready in two, one, let's go, 40 seconds. Forward, power back, forward, power back. Get a rhythm. So, remember that technique. When you lunge forward, that front knee should be behind the toe. Nice straight back, back knee, almost at a right angle, lowered to the floor. You're halfway, get a rhythm. Remember that form, nice, big steps. Let's go. You've got under 10 seconds. Keep powering through. Three, two, one. Rest there. Keep those legs moving. Next one, reverse lunge. Same technique, but we're going backwards. Alternate those legs each time. In three, two, one. There's your 40 seconds, so take a nice step back. Remember that front knee, power in. Step back, power through. Good, get a rhythm. Pace. Usually, I need a bigger step than I think I need. Go for it. You've got 10 seconds. Last three, two, one. Pause there, keep moving. Don't want those legs standing still. Good job. Next one, we've got our lateral lunge. So stay on one leg, take it to the side, time has started. Out, power in, out, power in. Really lunge to that side, keep that other leg nice and straight. When you power back in, try to keep that working foot off of the ground. And you're gonna change legs now. Change your side, other leg. Remember, your back should stay nice and straight with this side lunge. Last three, two, one. Rest there. Keep moving. This is going quick. Are you feeling it? If not, let's work a bit harder. Pick that pace up. Right, next one we've got our Bulgarian split. So, 
Take one leg forward, one leg back, make a start. You're just gonna take the knee down, extend. If you have anything behind you that you can put that back foot on, you can do this lunge that way. Okay, you're halfway. Change that leg round. If you have got anything behind you, you can pop that foot on. You'll feel this much more on that front leg. Last four, three, two, one. Rest there, good job. Right, keep moving, you're gonna get bored of me saying it. Next one, curtsy lunge. Hips stay square. Leg loops behind, squat to the floor. Time has started. You can alternate these. So, hips stay square. Foot butt comes behind. That back knee comes to the back heel on that front leg. Come on, curtsy for me, let's go. You've got 15 seconds. Keep those hips pointing at me. Come on, get those legs down. Last. Three, two, one. Good job. We've got three more. If you really put the speed and the power into these last three, you're going to end your session on a real high. Get ready for your lunge and knee drive. There's the buzzer. So, reverse lunge, power that knee at the top. Reverse lunge, power that knee. Take it back, power at the top. Stick with the same leg, I'll let you know when to swap. Down, power up. Okay, change legs, other leg stays down. Reverse, power. Get that back knee down, I'm watching. Come on, last, four, three, two, one, rest. Oh, I'm feeling it after that one, but we've got two more. Okay, our pendulum is our second to last. Get ready. So everybody, left leg stays down, right leg goes forward lunge, right leg goes back lunge. Like a pendulum, swinging forward and back. Keep that going. Remember that technique? I've got no room for it to do it that way. Okay, change legs. Now, back that right leg. Left leg forward, left leg back. Power through. Keep those legs hip width apart. Last four. Three, two, one. Press there. Oh, we've got one more. We've got our killer to finish. We've got our plyometric jump lunge to finish. 40 seconds all out. Let me see it. Get ready for that bell. And there it is. Start in your lunge. Jump, switch, switch, switch. Get those feet high off the floor, high as you can. Power through. If you can't jump because you've got ankle knee problems, no worries. Come back into your split squat, into your split lunge. I'll let you know when to swap. If you were doing your splits, it's already that time. Rest of you, power through with your plyometrics. You've got five seconds. Power. Go, go, go. And rest there. Okay. There we go. Oh, how are we doing out there? Are we alive and well? That one got me out of breath. All right, stay on those feet, guys. Keep moving. 
We're going to let our heart rates come down a little bit and then we're going to have a nice stretch. Get that breath back. Breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth. Small sips of water. Don't stand still. Pace forward and back. Do your hamstring curls, whatever you need. Don't stand still. Okay. Let's think about our lower body stretches. So, we're going to start lower leg, work our way up. You're alive, good. You're as hot as me by the looks of it. Oh, yeah, that is the right emoji. So, calf stretch. Give yourself enough room behind you, take a lunge back. That back leg's going to stay nice and straight. Press that back heel down into the floor. Keep that back in line so you've got a nice, straight line at the back. Really press that heel down into the ground. Okay, you're going to step in and change legs. So step in, same stretch, other leg. Nice straight line, press that back heel down into the floor. Don't forget your breathing everybody. Still in through the nose, out through the mouth. Lower that heart rate and breathing rate. Okay, step in. We're going to do back of the upper thigh next. So, small step forward. Bend that back leg, front leg stays nice and straight. Again, keep that back straight, always, good posture. If you can, you can lift back toe at the front and reach. Okay, stand tall, change legs. Step forward the other leg, nice and straight. Put your weight on that back bent leg. If you can, bring that toe up and reach at the front. Awesome, right, inner and outer thigh this time. So, take a nice wide stance, then you're gonna lean over to one side for me. Nice inner thigh stretch, keep that weight on that bent leg. Okay, transfer that weight over, same stretch, other side. Perfect, okay, we're gonna do outer thigh and bum. So bring those legs in. One foot onto the other upper thigh, get that knee out. If you can, take a squat down for me. Hold on to something if you need to. I'm gonna really test my balance now. If you can, really press that knee out. Perfect, we're gonna change. Other leg onto that upper thigh. Take a nice squat back, press that knee out. Good job, last few seconds. Perfect, right, back to centre. Let's do that main muscle, we should all feel it in today. So, front of the upper thigh, we're going to grab onto that ankle at the back. Keep those knees together and in line. Really push those hips out at the front. Again, hold something for balance if you need. All right, really push those hips out. Really increase that stretch as much as you can. Okay, we're gonna change legs. Lower that leg gently, other leg. Grab onto that ankle, knees together. Push those hips out. Hopefully our breathing rates have started to come down now. Keep going with that nice, gentle, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Really push those hips out, everybody. Really feel this down the upper thigh. Perfect, press there, give your legs a little shake. We've not done much upper body today, but we're just gonna have a little roll of the shoulders. Loosen those off. 
then interlock the hands at the front, push the shoulder blades apart at the back, nice little stretch, palms into the lower back, squeeze those elbows together. Perfect. And we will call it there. Thank you so much for joining me this afternoon. If you enjoyed it, if there are things you think we could do better, please do leave a comment. I would love to hear your feedback. As I always say, if you have been enjoying our classes during this very strange period, we would really love your feedback on our main page. Hit the recommend button, give us the feedback you'd like to give us, and that would be really, really great. Okay, I'm back tomorrow at 12 for core, so hopefully I will see some of you then. But until then, thank you very much, and I'll see you again soon. Bye, everybody.